personal trainer, I don't know how you guys do it and stuff, but I am known just as an athlete, as a, as a young man, as who I am, as a U.S. Marine, as a veteran. I'm a courage commitment, Simper Fidelis, Simp. That means S-E-M-P, always faithful, Marine Corps. So always, Simper Fidelis, Simp, always faithful, USMC term. Uh, Marines, go check out the, um, it's, it's funny, it's whatever. Go out to the, uh, the Virginia Museum of the Marine Corps. If you guys never been there, it's in Virginia, Quantico, Virginia. I've been there uh, a couple times myself with my wife and my family. Hi, honey. And we love it. It's free. To veterans out there, Marines, Army, Air Force, Coast Guard, Navy, anybody out there. Uh, the law, you know, if you're in the police uh, force, if you're a nurse, doctor, whatever. If you're a homeless person, I love you so much. Stop talking about homeless people, guys. Seriously. Uh, whoever you are, go to the Quantico Museum and uh, the Marine Corps Museum. It's beautiful. You've been there twice so far. One time I went to Fort Lee after duty when I was 19 years old uh, before coming home to res reservist side and going to graduating college and doing what I'm doing now with my family as well. Uh, I went there and we went there a second time with my wife and my family, my mama and my sisters. Sister, sister, sister. 
I'll never forget. Uh, oh, we take pictures and all that guy. Save memories too. But we keep. That's one thing I want to say. Keep pictures and videos and stuff, especially with your family, guys. Keep that with you forever. I mean, I do. Sacred family. Psalm 91, Bible verse. Matthew 5, 44. And Psalms 23, verse 4. You know, when I received this new, when we received our new laptop, luckily, thankfully, all of our pictures and stuff get saved. You know, when we did, they say desktop crashes and stuff. That's why I also like to put stuff on uh, safe places out there, whether it be online or so out there make sure you keep everything safe flash drives and luckily um, you know with the new one uh, battery or whatever the uh, flash drive the hard drive that uh, we received um, you know because we've had our pictures and stuff ever since we were young and we grew up together we got married right at St. Jane Francis uh, you know our church right down the corner went to school there and stuff which I talk about almost in every single uh, obviously it's a huge part of our lives my son was baptized there and we talk about it almost every single uh, you know, speech, video, session, whatever you want to call it. Uh, well, yeah, right on top of the, you know, the, the oh, good, headphones. Uh, you can hear me? All right. I wrote Psalms 23, verse 4. Uh, yeah, that's just my favorite one. It's talking about that a, a lot, too. Can't talk about it enough. Uh, even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. Me and my wife, we will fear no evil. Even if it's just something as small as that, hoping that, you know, good things like that stay with us forever, and it will. And then, I'm for you, for you are with me, your rod and your staff to comfort me. They anoint my head, obviously, with oil, <laughs> me and my family's blessing. Surely, blessings, love, and miracles, and joy, and grace, and love will be with us forever. Amen. Not only, not only it's my, 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 my Pop Pawn's favorite Bible verse, which I picked. I was talking to my best friend JP. This is what okay, so this is the video for today. Which is perfect for a Sunday. Yes, perfect. I like my best friend JP. I love you, JP. Schultz, I love you. Best friend Brandon Bab, I love you. Be safe out there when you're traveling. Uh, Blue Ranger Bab, got that Schultz, Black Ranger in check, and then the Red Ranger. So I'm talking to you now. JP, VIC. We got the green white ranger. Of course, pink and yellow rangers swag was up. Um, drink for that one. Coffee, by the way. Whatever you're drinking, tea, coffee, juice, water, some uh, little bit of wine, good stuff, beer, whatever. Cool. You know what I'm saying? Just make sure you're of age, obviously, 21 and over. Do not drive. Seriously, guys, don't drive. I learned some people, I know some people who learned that the hard way. Some Chinese people, you know, who are good friends. <coughs> Matthew. <laughs> and, uh, you know, be gone in the hard way. Young bro, what is that? Was that a stone? Did you feel that? It's a kiss. Uh -huh. Hey, and JP, this is to all my homies. All my homies. <laughs> all my homies. <laughs> awesome powers of funny. Call me at a good time when I was just singing and doing some praising myself. I'm gonna continue that after we get done. This, you know, that doesn't stop me. I can multitask. I'm the youngest son of a big, a huge family, so I can I can mess around. I can get ready. I can cause a little ruckus in a good way, in a lawful way. L A W F B L. You already know. Forever we did not fall. We rose up against, along with the law. Sammy I'm sure you Andrea Davini. Um freaking Yeah, but so I just remember I'm sure he will the members too. We were like boys. Weight room brothers, we got we got big together pretty much, you know, we started out in the weight room. This is a you know, it's the personal training entrepreneur stuff. I stay we stay fit and everything, but it all started even before college and doing all that stuff. And uh, you, you know, of course, we both served. He's in the Air Force, veteran. He's married to a godly man like me. I'm a Marine. Uh, we play ball together. So, you know, same side of the field on defense. You know, well, uh, always forever in the weight room. And out, and even when we're out the weight room, we're in the weight room, looking out for each other and stuff. It's 
especially with the Lord by our side. And he went to our, he went to my school too, our, our school, uh, our school, yeah, back in the day. Um, and we were just talking, I remember, I forgot what he said, his, I think he said his favorite, favorite Bible, Bible verse was like Philippians 4.13, which is dope, which is one of my favorites as well. And then I was like, I really look into it, especially being a Catholic Christian man I am, being confirmed, and, you know, and all that stuff. Holy matrimony, baptized, Eucharist, all that in the seven sacraments. I uh, try to keep, you know, and a kingdom father myself, a kingdom husband. That's no joke. That's not just a freaking alias. That's a, it's more than a job. It's more than a career. It's a calling. So I picked 23 for because the funniest reason because my football number was 23 and once again I think I mentioned this before but cool things got to be brought back up it's Sunday hallelujah the tomb is empty and my lacrosse number is 4 so I just picked I, I picked Psalms uh, because it seemed easy to read it was a lot of the other this is serious now. I was like 16 and 17 years old and we were out of the weight room at the time, we were probably just kicking it. We weren't in school or whatever. He was probably just hitting me up, texting, something like that. We were just kicking it as young men, you know. When we weren't working out and we weren't in this classroom and we weren't, you know, with our shawty. Uh, we were talking about either football, sports, the Lord, our faith, hope, Bible verses, family, love, grace, wine, tequila, good time, bad times, the military. But anyways... Well, this is very good on track. We run track too together. A lot of mother does for a chunk of you. I mentioned this. And, uh, JP was, uh, told me that, and, uh, I picked it out and I read it. And, lo and behold, it was my Pop Hong, who's also a fellow Marine, who's in heaven now, along with my, you know, other grandparents. We all need people, my brother Ben. A fellow Marine, like I said, a corporal like myself. And it was his favorite too. His favorite too. And he's got Cherokee as well. It's pretty dope. Awesome stuff. Why am I talking about this? Because it's just uh, it's a quinky dink. Coincidences. Uh, believe in miracles. Believe in God's timing. Believe in faith. Walk by faith, not by sight. Joshua. You know, Joshua. Walk by faith, not by sight. We have this in our home here. It's blessed, and we're all blessed. Uh, we are. We are blessed. We're all prayed up. Um, Psalms 23, verse 4. But also a funny thing because, you know, luckily I'm blessed. I don't have any concussions or anything. I never got really, really badly injured on the field. Everything happened. Well, I got some stuff that happened afterwards while working and stuff. But it wasn't anything serious. It was just from work. It's work stuff, but everything's good now. It, was, it had nothing to do with, like, the head. Uh, luckily it was just bone stuff that got uh, healed, like a broken wrist. I got healed within like a couple months. Luckily, I was blessed and raised by God. It wasn't anything. I'm here breathing and I'm very healthy, as you can tell. <laughs> Amen. Blessed. You know? But all the other books in the Bible and chapters and whatnot, they all seem like really long. They were really long. And then I looked at Psalms with a P. P-S-A-L-M-S. P is silent. And they were easy to read. They were for my age, I'm ADHD, I don't know, man. I'm more of an athlete, I wasn't too, but I liked reading, but uh, I was more into like fiction stuff, you know, like Harry Potter, which I still am today, as you can tell, I'm still a nerd, uh, I liked video games more, I like playing outside, outdoors, doing do a key, I love being outside, swimming, working out, playing sports, being with family, partying, you know, in a fun, in a fun way, spending time with friends and family, dancing, you know, unleashing the inner angel inside of us, which we all can be, slim out, the spirit is beautiful, so I picked Psalms because of that, <laughs> because they were shorter, they were short and sweet, if you will, for my, uh, for me, as the youngest boy in the of Israel, it's just what I want to do, and uh, I picked that because of those numbers, and it's one of the greatest numbers ever, and lo and behold, another reason why I'm in confirmed as a name of David because that ruddy boy was the same one who when he destroyed Goliath and the Philistines and saved God's people 
as a young man, as a shepherd boy, probably, I don't know, uh, he went in there, man, with nothing except a sling. So they say, the stones. He won that big or short. Yeah, was he short? I guess maybe. I don't know, short temper, maybe, like Joe Pesci. I don't know. But, uh, he said that before he defeated that Philistine. They're big and bad Goliath. And the rest of them. With that, with, by just saying that, Psalms 23, verse 4. Hopefully, the Lord will be with him. Confidently. Probably not confidently, honestly. Probably maybe had, I don't know. Who knows? But that's the story, and that's true. And I found that out, once again, quickly in coincidence, after I already picked that Bible verse as my favorite. After. That's the key thing. You have to remember all this stuff. This all got to happen afterwards. After I picked that, just randomly. Well, not randomly, but you know, whatever they already mentioned. Then you, I find out stuff later about this wonderful King David, David. You know, he's just a king, right? This psalm and this psalm, that's cool. Ahab, right? I don't care. There's a bunch of names out there you guys can pick. God, I didn't pick it. God gave it to me. The Lord, the angels. It means a lot to, all, to us. Oh, goodness gracious, it means a lot to the Lord. Shit, that stone comes back around. You know, the rock and stuff, amen? So that is awesome. And it's true. It's a short and sweet one. Maybe like David. <laughs> About that. Another coinky So believe in coincidences, coinky dinks, whatever you want to call it. Because they're not just quinks, coincidences. Quinky dink. It's funny to say that. They're not just that, though. They are ordered by the Lord. Jeremiah. Higher than that, of course, is the Lord. But everything happens, as my older sister Shannon says. It's effing true. Everything happens. Nothing is random. We're all divinely guided in our own way by the Lord. And I was, and still am, and always will be, as we all are. Don't lose connection with our Lord. And your family, if you love one, one time. And uh, everything happens for a reason. Probably going to label with that. But well, that's a true story about my favorite Bible verse, Psalms 23, verse 4. Just going back to sharing it with a best friend of mine. I'll say his name once again. JP, P-I-C, 28. Hey, I'm 28 years old. 28 plus, you know, I know, P-I-C. We call each other P-I-C. It's a funny thing from a movie, you know. No models. P-I-C, it's like bestie. Shawty, you know, slang. And it's all, it's all great. It's all great, baby. Fruitful. Great. All of y'all, and I hope all of y'all have amazing blessings of love and light. Beautiful auras of rainbows like a peacock. I am. I hope you are too. Let that spirit out. You know, you ain't gonna lose. Don't be scared. You know, you're right here. You're good to go. Take care of yourself. Guys, with that being said, I hope you're doing well in your goals and all that good stuff. You know, you got very close with all that. As you can tell, I'll leave it at that. And vice versa with me, watch out for each other. Make sure you continue to get a couple hours of good sleep every now and then. Make sure you continue to eat pretty, pretty good. You know, not too much. Make sure you continue to take care of yourself and hygiene. Take care of your family. Make sure you continue to, uh, you know, respect one another. You get in your prayer and blessings time, whatever that may be. Make sure you remember to call up a good friend of yours, like what I do. Best friends, brothers and sisters. And you keep your mother and father close. Of course, you respect them. Take commandments and they respect you and love you. And of course, make sure you uh, continue to always have your son or daughters under your wings, like what I do with mine, as a big angel, like my wifey, uh, Pink Ranger. <clears throat> All right? And uh, keep Jesus very close forever and always until the end of time. All right? I love you so much. And uh, everything happens for a reason. And coincidences. They aren't just coincidences, they're miracles itself. And it just started from sharing that. Our favorite Bible verses, two Christian kids, two young Catholic kids, whatever you want to call us. You know, young men, 16, 17 years old. Right at Northeast High School. After I transferred from Spalding when I was in 9th grade. 
He's a football player, myself, I played lacrosse, he played, and I played track, and he did play football. He wrestled, and he played lacrosse, and I also wrestled too. And he does track as well. You know, <clears throat> this the two Christian kids, you know, tan, uh, oiled up Christian kids. You know, the best friend of mine. He always will be, right? Fellow teammate, brother, brother of Christ, and that's a true story about Psalms 23, verse 4, and my favorite Bible verse. For anybody who wants to listen, whatever. And maybe uh, you guys, why don't you guys go do something like that too? And share. Sharing is caring. Pick one out, and I don't know, God will lead you away. Talk to your mommy, talk to your daddy, talk to family and friends, like what I do, what, what I still do. Uh, and amazing, miracle, miraculous things guided by the Lord will happen like that for you. Most likely. Yeah. So. Peacock spirit animal. For all for all time. It's a cool poncho. Right? Ain't no hate, nothing but love, nothing but positive good vibes and stuff like that. So, amen. Remind me to look up two things. Angel numbers four four four. I've been seeing five 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 eight eight eight. One one one. Um, some good homework for me, and then I'll do uh, the peacock spirit animal, which has always been, as you can tell, this was our spirit. Me and my wife, well, she got me that. Right now she's doing her Bible study with her girlfriends. Uh, yeah, but that's uh, spirit catcher, as they call it. Dream catcher is just a cool thing, you know, giving positive, good, beautiful blessings and stuff like that. A peacock. It's like you know, purple and blue, beautiful colors. Beautiful colors. All colors are beautiful. Though. Colors of the rainbow. Peacock's very cool. To remind me, um, I got to do some stuff. Let's see the book, my research on that. Cool stuff too. It's got to be something really great. I've always loved the peacock. I think everybody loves the peacock, and that's something that a lot of people have been the little, like girls and angels and you know signs and friends and uh, telling me that hey, look at peacock, peacock. Look into that. So I guess I'll look into that too if I get bored. But, um, um, Multitasking here. <laughs> we're at the hay uh, later on tonight, you know, this evening, after our, yeah, our Sunday. You know, after we have some, make sure you guys eat some good chow and hygiene and all that good stuff and stay love and light. Remember to always laugh and give and humor. Stay humored up. I love that word. Stay humored up. H U M O R E D. Humored. Stay humored up. Uh, and know your friends and family got you. Amen? cool word for today and this I named it something new as you saw I went from friendly and spectacular which it always will forever be when I want to do a little switch up and you know share dangle want to show up it's around Halloween in a good way so now it's wonderful and loving as it always was that too it's just it's just different words to talk about the same awesome thing this love of ours this love of ours La Vida Loca this uh, beautiful creation that God has given us, this mechanisms that, and gifts that we can use for bueno, which means good in Spanish, to uplift. Even when times seem rough, even when we're sick, even Corinthians 13, 4 through 8, of course, even when it seems like uh, all the cards have fallen, I don't play cards. Even when, even when it seems like uh, the treadmill is broken, can't run no more. I don't have a trip no more. I run in the wilderness. I run outside. Even when it seems like all the wine is gone and stuff, it's okay. I'm not that huge of a drinker anyway. So I, I have no problem with drinking tea, water, whatever. Get the breath. God will make a way. God's got you. But it feels like all the food is run out. Uh, man, I'm a Marine. I can, I'm good. I got a family. I, I got a wife. I'm going to be good. Obviously, we have a home. Dress how we want, and everybody. Be yourselves. Dress. Be stylish. Be swagalicious. Dress how you want. Be who you are. Be who you are. Exactly who the Lord made you. That's what I say. That's what I. Should, that's pretty awesome. And no one has any room to judge another. If they do, then they're guilty of being, uh, you know, wrong. So, but that's with them and God too. Everybody can repent. There's room for forgiveness of everybody in the kingdom of the Lord. Okay? There's, uh, everybody. God loves everybody. And they're, 
as wise, awesome HBK said, Shawn Michaels, you, know, you can go as far out as a, and you, you can always come back. You know, as far as you go, you can always be saved. Everything hinders on hope. True. I agree with that. And I, I love Shawn Michaels. He's my favorite wrestler. He's a godly man, Christian man, Catholic man, like myself. And he's the youngest brother as well. Just like, I don't know, other people. John Cena, Mark Wahlberg, I don't know. I'm the youngest brother, too. And David was the youngest brother, is the youngest brother. But Jacob's like the youngest, brother, the old elder one. So, And my name's Jacob, too. And I already told you about the other man. <laughs> I do, like, every day. It's not the man. <laughs> oh, don't worry, I'm going to start singing and stuff after this day. Go Ravens, by the way. Yeah, I got the Ed Reed jersey right there. On my college, on my backpack, my marine pack that I... We travel with when we travel every now and then. We travel light. You know, we don't travel too heavy, you know. Like Aragorn said, let's travel light. Let's hunt some orc. Yeah, great quote. I love Lord of the Rings. Yeah, 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 yeah. Tight. You may have my sword. Amen. I remember watching that great memories, watching that with the siblings and stuff back in the day. And when I was younger. I remember all that stuff. I'm a great memory. Great memory. Amen. You know, bust out and dance when you're praying to a little bit too loud, then I'll be like, oh, my bad. And do something else. Or go run it and do it. Like what I do. Work out somewhere and do it. Be loud as you want. Be loud as you want. That's the whole point. It's called praising. You know? Chanting, as, my, as beautiful Jessica Alba would say. Snake. I like to call it snake medicine. Jake the snake. It's like snake. Medicine. Going back to Native American roots. Uh, it's, it's, you can just call it as uh, venting. It's venting. It's, uh, it's shedding. You bring out new skin. Not no snake, but becoming that peacock in your new form with wings. They'll fly. Do peacocks fly? They do now. They can if they want. You know, like your color show, brother, sisters. Be that full version of yourself. And that's exactly why I chose to do what I did as David and out there and still do to this day. To be open. I am the most open book in the world. Well, a lot of people are, but, you know, it's good. It's good for you. It's good for other people. And it gives children, it gives women, it gives people out there faith. It gives them hope. It gives them courage. It gives them, it gives them, it gives them that something, that light, that little light, this little light of mine. I'm a let it shine, let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. And you never know. It can help a lot of people out there. So go out and do it. Amen. Chant, dance around, sing like these beautiful people right here. My people, brothers and sisters, our people, everybody, God's people. Sing, chant, move around, do a little dance. Don't hurt yourself too bad, like the amazing Spider Man says. You, know, don't, you don't need to beat yourself up. But have fun, and uh, may the Lord always be with you. comfortable with who you are. Be comfortable, comfortable, able. Be comfortable with who you are. The way God made you. Any color you are, uh, brothers and sisters out there, you're beautiful the way God made you. I am too. And you are as well. You're beautiful the way God made you inside and out. And let's all be peacocks that your colors show of how beautiful you are. Walk by faith and not by sight. Eagles, spirit animal. Northeast Eagles. Never forget where you came from. Never give up, brother. So free. Put the mouth on. How about that? How about them apples? And no one has, what I said before, and no one has any room to judge another. But I got my little homework about the angel numbers of Ryan. You know, I do the uh, peacocking when 
Remember, if it doesn't resonate, don't let it resonate. If it's negative or anything like that, just like bad dreams or stupid nightmares and stuff like that, that's not a bad guy. Just cut it off. Easy as crap. It's just, oh, okay, once again, enemies try to, okay, some bad vibes. It's trying to attack. Oh, cool. All right, all right. Whatever. I still slept like a baby. We still sleeping good. We still looking good. We still eating good. We still look good. You know, we still sing good. We still talk. Intelligent as crap. Wisdom. The lamp is still lit. The pilot light that never went out, that is me, the pilot light, like a pilot light underneath the oven in the kitchen, like in the movie Zathora, that keeps everything going, that one light, you gotta actually, if you blow it out, it's, it's still gonna come back, but you don't control it, just like my wives, they're angels, they're always with me, even if it looks like they're not, it's an invisible pilot light, I'm that light that won't ever go out, and you can be that too, that pilot light, ignite, like my rap song, burn, <clears throat> remix. Be little Caribbean friends, Sammy Dumpshot, like you know, little artists, nick nicknames that people have. Have fun with it. That pilot light, the Aries, the fire, the Holy Spirit that won't ever go out, and that will light up the rest of the house. So electricity, the flames, literally for cooking, because we all gotta eat, right? We all gotta stay warm. It's October 16th. That pilot light, stay warm. <laughs> P I L O T. That pirate, if you guys like Pirates of the Caribbean, it could be like a cool pirate light too. Like, oh, the one pirate that never gave up when everybody was sinking and he, there was one young pirate boy you know because older pirates were all given out and stuff maybe drunk too drunk who knows but there was young david a pirate boy maybe in a jack the movie jack sparrow maybe he's up in the nest you know the crow's nest or maybe he's out uh, in the shepherd uh, you know the shepherd boy but that one you know you can use different uh words to describe people of the same breed you know who, the same walks of life cut from the same cloth once again as my beautiful sister shannon would say you know <laughs> as I'm wearing my cool poncho, beautiful poncho. I have another one too. My wife has the same one. We got it from the Ocean, Ocean City. That's our spot. <laughs> we always still have that. Keep all our stuff. It's comfortable. It's crap. You know. But even when it's not too cold, uh, we are the Care Bears, Brother Bears, hibernate. You know, we keep each other warm and stuff. But there was that one pirate light, that one pilot light, that one, that one warrior, that one, uh, that singer. You know, they started singing. It's about time. Pirates Care being three. Remember at the beginning? They started singing, so it's about time. This is all true shit. Facts. Watch Disney, dog. Jack Sparrow, Johnny Depp, we love you. That one pirate that got pilot light that ignited everybody else, the spirits, like Bone Thugs and Harmony, to start singing and rapping and a miracle in itself when everything seemed, you know, the phoenix rising from the ashes, Harry Potter. The tears of the phoenix can heal others. And vice versa, we can all be that. Uh, Queens and Kings, 144, Heaven on Earth. That pilot, pilot, P I L O T, and pirate, P I R A T E, in this loving and wonderful speech of ours, that just never stopped singing, and never gave up, and it ignited everybody else to be the greatest pirate ship, quote unquote, Mother Earth, Mother Gaia. Hopefully, ever, to keep it going, because that love never dies. Our love never dies, unless we're dying eggs together. Forever flamed up. It's called true love, ladies and gentlemen. King of Mary, of Jesus. And it's that pilot, pirate light that will ignite with the Holy Spirit, whichever way they can, to be anointed with that. If you want to talk about oil, that's oil right there that will ever shut up in a good way. And will never give up. We'll never give in, never give up. He keeps it real. He keeps it OG. Israel. <sighs> to create loving other kingdoms out there for brothers and sisters everywhere. To uh, be and it usually comes in big families, whatever family you're in. The youngest girl it could be a boy, it could be twins, it could be lovers. That love they have can inspire and motivate others, which is exactly why we do this. Tarzan and Nisha, amen. Thank you so much. The pilot, pilot light, that just never give up. There's your spirit, buddy. It's just fun. Okay. All right. Didn't even need it. Who I would say would be like David, the pilot pirate, the warrior that got called out and saved everybody and he gained tens of thousands, along with Jesus and the people of the Lord. Moses, the pilot pirate that never gave up, forever burning, even though when it looks like it's not. It's even when it looks like it's not there, it's there. Like my angel, like Adam and Eve, like God, invisible Lord, 
who is very ever present as ever, is going to give you eyes. He's going to be there to see. Observe Matthew 28 20. I read it yesterday. Don't worry. Because I do what I do. I say what I do. I walk the walk and talk the talk. Remember, continue giving yourself to the PAT, pat yourself on the back. You know what I'm saying? Katana. Rihanna. Swords. And lift each other up. Passing each other better training. Thank you very much. I got the blue bandana right here. Uh, mermaids found Leo and Rio. Alright. Blessings. I don't know. What the heck I'm going to label this? Probably something cool. Probably something chill. As it always is. Ain't nothing changed. I'm not beloved, baby. But yeah, that's like the warrior inside all of us. As a wise, beautiful woman told me, I love you so much. That we'll never give up. Spirit! The movie Spirit. There's your stallions. There's your horses. I gotta watch the movie. I love that movie. Spirit. With our shirts. My son Dami, we have the shirts. My wife, you know, we love Spirit. I gotta watch that later on. It's a great movie. My brothers and sisters love it too. And I love it. I've always loved it too. How can you how can you not? My mama loves it. I love you, mama. I love you, you daddy. I love I love you all. I love everybody. The spirit that could not be defeated. Like that could be all of us, that pilot light, that pirate light. You know the analogy I'm using? You, you get in, hopefully you're getting this uh, picture I'm painting. It's very great. It's not abstract. It's not very abstract. It's very, I would say, perfect the way God gave it to me. No pain, right? It's in your art class. It's realness. Yeah? So you could be that David, the Archangel Michael, just because it looks like the fire light is burnt out and it's all done and all the team's over. It. This team's over with the Ravens, you know, all, or whoever, whichever team out there. That your season's over. You're hurt, man. You're done. And another dog, Rocky, comes back or whatever. And then, oh yeah, David or whatever. Uh, Jack Sparrow gets the compass. Whatever you want to use, the one that everyone counts out, the one that everybody counts out, you know. Or is like, oh shit, and they end up saving not only themselves, of course, but everybody else and the people, their people, the people on the Lord, uh, the parish, friends, and family through just uh, God most amazing, highest up, invisible spirit, soul, pirate light, flame ever. He created us, we come from him. Amen. Love. That's how we're all created. Love. It's more than just two people. It's spirit, love, angels. Oh, I remembered it. It's a spirit that could not be broken. D peps because I like to put a little bit of Dr. Pepper in my coffee too, but I already did. It's only my second cup. I've been doing good on uh, not drinking too much coffee for myself. You know, not because anybody else tells me to do anything. I do everything fine, but just for myself. I want to get too. Sometimes when I drink too much caffeine, a lot of people get. I'm already ADHD. I'm already pretty neurotic in a good way. It's good to be neurotic. It means you're healthy. It means you're sober. It means you're wise. It means you're strong. It means you're confident. It means you have feelings. It means you're the opposite of numb. Like, you're not depressed. You're worried about anything. Like, that's like me. That's what I am. The opposite of depressed. Hopefully you guys can be like that too. Uh, you know, so sometimes I'm already pretty nervous in a good way. We all should be. Uh, as human beings. You know. Uh, but coffee just kind of adds that to it. Just like more like shaky wise. Not shaky in a bad way, but shaky as in like coffee. You know, the coffee shakes? Is that, that's a thing. Woman, ladies and gentlemen, come on. We know about that. We all do that. So, but I'm not always going good. I'm just not eating too many spicy foods for me. My personal goals. I hope you guys do well. Uh, pretty awesome in your goals too. Amen. Amen. Stretching not too much when I work out. I'm not going too far. You know, I've been doing good. Like what I said at the beginning of this session, or not overtraining. No fatigue, you know, keeping my energies out, my sugars, not overtraining, like I said. Um, there's another word for that. I've said it before in the email, it's all good. Uh, yeah. Which is good. 
did for me as an athlete, and as a man, and as a personal trainer. Uh, I feel good. I hope you guys all feel good too. <laughs> about it for this one guys in 40 minutes I'll leave with this accordingly peacock spirit animal angel number 111 angel number 444 everybody loves 55 555 five. something about it I'm the fifth born in my family youngest son and I'm the fifth born total I got two younger sisters seven total youngest boy I don't know something about it yeah, I like it because my placement in, in this beautiful thing called life and this beautiful family of mine uh, and know that not everything is coincidences. I do love that word, quinky dinks, but it's the miracles of the Lord. And uh, sharing, I was able to good story of my baby, fav my baby, my favorite Bible verse I share with my old best, my, you know, my still best friend to this day. And everything happens for a reason. All right, so. Cool. This has been the wonderful and loving speech of ours for this beautiful Sunday of October 16th. And I, uh, I'll see you all around. See you in Tarzan Phoenicia. Stay close, stay warm, stay warm. Stay warm! I don't know. Where's the tea? There it is. Stay warm! Alright? Put the heater on, man. Get hot. Sweat it out. That's what, another reason why I always work out too, guys. Health and exercise. What do we do? It's good to work out especially if you do party if you drink I don't know we all do I'm growing up whatever get it next morning or next day don't forget to work out and sweat all those toxins out and shit you know and then replenish your body with uh, the necessary nutrients and uh, good foods and spices and, you know beverages of the Lord or you know that you gotta do to uh, have your, your, little, your little fun fun time <laughs> Now, don't do drugs with that being said and stay in school obviously all right everybody and uh look out for each other all right all right hang loose hang it up okay. all right well i'll see y'all later see ya i love you thank you you're pretty hot too call me hot it's like I'm getting a little late tonight <laughs> in a good way just hey lay it up lay it up you don't need to dunk it lay it up David I don't know alright see y'all later stay cool put the ones up put the twos I don't even care I love you I do